hello and welcome to the Q and A. Uh, thank you guys for turning out pretty well. Thirteen or fourteen comments, questions. So let's, I'm gonna I'm gonna get right onto these. So first question right here is by Domewagon0315. He asks, Have you ever considered doing a let's play on this channel? If so, any chance of Legend of Zelda or Minecraft let's play? And he puts this um, parentheses, especially with your friends on Minecraft. Don't wagon, my boy. You know, I mean, I would love to, but I, I can't live com right now or anything. So it would be cool, but you, I mean, like I could do it, but it'd just be like five or ten minutes each. I mean, which fifteen like that? I mean, that's it's it's a normal. It, that would be a normal let's play episode, but I would have to like talk over it or just like upload it just raw because I mean, I, yeah, like don't have raw. Uh, live com able ability I guess I don't know but maybe in the future bud um, that is a possibility though um, then he asks again uh, this is actually a serious situation so let's uh, let's be serious about this I've had been I've been having some trouble at school I bullied this pussy and he started to tell on me is there any way to scare him to not tell me what I or or what should I do Please answer. I need your help. <laughs> Everybody likes so he can see this. All right, uh, don't wagon. Uh, you know I don't bully people, but I understand your situation um, because I bully kids on the internet, which I just contradict myself. But it doesn't matter uh, because I, I roast people on the internet. So um, and I believe I actually roasted you. But <laughs> so is there any way I could? I mean, what I would do is just bully him even harder. You know. Like just tell him like, fuck it. If you if you tell on me one more time, then I'm a beast of shit at you. And then he'd be like, okay, sorry, man. And he would start crying, and he wouldn't even tell his mom. So just bully him to not telling you. Um, yeah. Next question again by Dome Wagon. He asks, when did you and Dome Wagon first meet? Same with all the other people you have roasted. I uh, mean, I uh, mean, Dome Wagon, we go way back uh, to fourth grade basketball. He was a rager, um, you know, his his ginger side got the best of him, and he just raged, and I, I mean, yeah, we played on the basketball team together. Um, other people I've roasted, Taco Crumb, me and him, I don't even know. I think that was probably like, we had a class in second grade, but um, I really first met him like probably eighth grade or so, you know, or summer, you know, we would always ride bikes together, and then that pussy ass Connor, I don't even know, man. He probably just like came to me all life, like, eh, you can be the best in me. And I was like, yeah, sure, fuck off, man. I don't even know. Um, Ian Kinsler, I don't even know who you are. If Ian, if you're watching this, tell me who you fucking are. I mean, I don't even know if that's your real name. Um, but thanks, thanks for the support. You always commenting and shit. He has how long is the slong? Schlong? Um. Um, due to purposes of not wanting to get people wet in this video, uh, I'm gonna keep that disclosed. Sorry. Um, Brock Hip asks, boobs or butt? Sorry, Brock. Um, I don't look at women like that. Next question. Brock Hip asks, blonde, brunette, or redhead? <sighs> Again, um, I think women are beautiful in all ways. Next question. Brock Hip asks, what are your top three weapons in a zombie apocalypse? Finally, a good question by Brock Kid. All right, um, you know what? I I didn't think about this one enough, but definitely a ray gun. <laughs> um, a saw like a chainsaw, so I can slice people up. Then last one, oh man, I'd have to go. I'd have to go with the ACR 6.1, 6.8 MW3 style. Um, then. Once again, last question from Brock Hip: Ford or Chevy? I, I didn't, I didn't do my research, but I, I'm gonna just say shit, Ford, <laughs> Ford, because that's, I don't know, Ford is cool, I guess, I don't know. Um, all around gameplay, ass. Any word on how your tennis career is coming along? Well, um, it, that's it's kind of a still sensitive topic to me. Um, it seems like I retired only a few days ago, but, um, you know, I might be getting back into it. I don't know. Um, the season's not 
starting to a long time away, so I got some time to sit on it and think about it. So right now it's just kind of been sitting still, but uh, I'll keep you keep you guys up uh, updated. <laughs> Sorry. And then uh, pin slat ass lacrosse or water polo. Water polo would be pretty cool, but lacrosse like I see then people play. You no, know, I mean you can like body check people. I think. I mean, just playing with the stick and like, pshh, like bang it in, and then the goal, like, it just looks cool. Lacrosse, definitely. Then the last three are from Like a Buckeye. He asks, What are your thoughts on heterosexual marriage? I'm in full support of heterosexual marriage. And I'm not even gonna go into homosexual, so don't, don't even give me start on that, man. Um, he asks, Favorite game? Super Mario 2, baby! Just kidding. Um, I don't know. Sonic, maybe. Just, uh, I don't know. Fuck it. Um, I, I feel like this question is asked every single time. All right, Xbox One. I'm, I'm gonna give the truth. Xbox One, Call of Duty, Advanced Warfare. Um, <laughs> hate me. Uh, and the last question right here. So, like a book I ask, I'm trying to romanticize my woman a bit. But I don't think I'm doing it right. How do you romance your woman? Okay, well, what I do is I say, hey, what's up? Smiley face. Emphi emphasize the smiley face. If she sends something back, she wants the D. That's all you have to do. And that's pretty much it. No more questions. Thank you guys for commenting. For those who didn't, I, I don't even want to... Boy, I'm about to roast all of you guys who didn't leave a comment in that video. But thank you guys for watching, and that is it. I'll see you guys later. Bye.